If you want to experience the very best of life, you must believe that you deserve the best. Too many religious people are taught to believe that they don't deserve anything. And some religious people even pray that prayer. Oh, Lord, I know I'm not worthy. I'm going to ask for some confessions on national television. How many of you have ever prayed a prayer like that? Lord, I know I'm not worthy. Come on, up with those hands. Chicken. All right, I have too. I know better now. I know the truth and I'm free. But listen, anything that you don't feel you're worthy of, you can't have. Anything that you feel you do not deserve, that you're not worthy of, you automatically cut yourself off from that good. Listen, you cross yourself up when you pray and ask the presence of God in you for something, and then you say, now, Lord, I know I'm not worthy. You might as well forget it, honey. <laughs> Believe that you deserve the best. Now, let me give you a bombshell. I want everybody to get quiet. Everybody just walk and sit in the nearest empty seat. Quickly, listen. I want you to hear this. If you ever heard anything, I'm going to tell you something that's only going to take 10 seconds to tell you. But I want you to hear this if you forget everything else I've said. Because what I'm about to tell you will bring you anything good that you desire, and it will bring it to you quickly. It will bring it to you in the nowness of consciousness. Listen. Anything that you can actually think and feel that you are worthy of must come to you. Don't clap yet. Hold on. I want to be redundant about this. Please listen. Hang on to every word. Anything that you can honestly think and feel that you deserve must come to you. If any person in this congregation are listening on the radio or looking at on t television, if you can honestly think and feel that you are worthy and deserve a million dollars, that million dollars must come to you. which we call the science of living we say it this way whatever you want in your experience hold it first of all accept it first of all in your consciousness if you could get a million dollar feeling a million dollars would have to come to you if it looked like it was dropping out of the sky it wouldn't actually be coming from outside of you. It would be coming from within your own consciousness. And of course, this is one of the great mystic secrets. Nothing really comes to you from outside of you. Everything comes to you from within your own consciousness. Everything comes to you from within your own inner feeling about yourself. Not according to what others think and feel about you, but your experiences come to you your cursing or your blessing, your good or your evil comes to you out of your own inner consciousness. And once again, let me make the startling statement. If any person could honestly feel and think that he is deserving and worthy of a million dollars, that million dollars would come to him so fast until it would make his head spin. Now, wait a minute. We've had an example in the service. Mother Packnett, who used to be the blind old lady and who was healed. And she was taught by me and many of our services that we deserve the best. This is what I teach the people, that you deserve the best. You deserve the best because you're God's child. You don't have to beg God for anything. The day of begging, praying is over. This is the day of accepting the goodness of God. <laughs> 